Plainville family will once again welcome hundreds to their haunted house for Halloween, a popular spot for trick-or-treaters and some added entertainment. News 8's Mike Mascadrelli gives us a closer look at their Halloween display that's also benefiting families in need. The Bucci's Halloween house is back from the dead with a lot more spooky decorations. Have you ever been concerned that you're display is too scary. <laughs> no, actually too scary. I guess there's never too scary when you have uh, little kids coming around and, and they start crying, then you know you did a good job. I mean, hey, you know, they want to come here. <laughs> that's something that might happen, you know, so that's their choice. Dylan and Dan Bucci spent the last month setting up their frightening display. Everything is just a apple juice bottle and a mannequin head and some piping for the arms. Um, and just some cloth, so we created most, basically, everything here. But they tell me it's Mrs. Butcher who is the mastermind behind it all. 99% my wife's idea and 1% my idea. She is the one to, to blame or the one to, uh, you know, congratulate for all this, really. I, I wouldn't do it uh, without her kind of prodding and pushing. So uh, how does it feel to be a neighbor to this guy over here? when you see a display like this? Well, it's pretty daunting because my granddaughter said the other day, we got to do something with our decorations. The YWCA dance instructor Christine's girls will once again perform their thrillers routine Halloween night at the Bucci's house. Police shutting down the road for the show, now an annual tradition. It's like a, a rite of passage for the, the dancers. They can't wait to be of age to do thriller. The Bucci's haunted house always have things that surprise you, and there may be some things that jump out at you. There are some Halloween movie villains here next to me. This is a display that continues to grow every year, and it also does good for the community, the Plainville Community Food Pantry on the receiving end. Collecting canned and non-perishable foods in the last seven years, the Bucci's have raised over 5,000 pounds of food from all of the donations. And this is amazing, and the work that they do, um, if you just look around, and I hope people will come out and see this event, it's, it's beautiful, and it helps a lot of people in need. Last year, the food donated went to 140 households, a Halloween house serving up a scare and also making a difference. In Plainville, Mike Mascadrelli, News 8.